Hey everybody, it's your friendly neighborhood gamer XL3 coming at ya. And I want to talk to you guys something about something. You know, I was gonna make a, a different video today, however, uh, I didn't really feel like it, and I feel like it would take a bit too much time, so I got pushed back a little bit. However, I decided to upload something because I haven't been uploading recently because I've been kind of busy with a couple things. So I just wanted to make this quick video on a whim just to have something to upload. And what am I reviewing slash ranting about today? It's one of these. For those of you who don't know, and some of you might not know, especially those of you who live in the United States and not Canada, this is what's called a Joe Louis or Joss Lewis or whatever they're called. And, um... And uh, these th what these things are basically, and I'll hold it up a bit closer, is they're basically a chocolate-covered red velvet cake with a whipped cream in the middle. And that sounds so great, right? It sounds like, wow, that sounds like a really great candy. However, the problem rely or lies in that the fact that they're, these are just awful. They're just awful. Uh, first off, um, I mean, like, the only good thing I can say about is the price, which is about five six bucks per big package and you get about eight of these and for that's a lot that's like for eight bucks you can get either these or a little Caesar's pizza i don't really see the difference in quality though but however what i have uh done is i decided hey uh i wanted to make this because my mom recently got these and i used to have these all the time in my lunch in like elementary from like grade two to like grade six i had these almost every day and and I just didn't really say anything to my mom. I just I was just like, hey, Joe Louie, hooray! And these things, and you're gonna see why. Uh, so let's not beat around the bush anymore. Uh, let's go. So uh, here's the package up front. Uh, the new package looks a lot cleaner. However, the old package is even better. But you can even see you can hear it all crinkling. And the first problem relies is in the packaging. This is really a big uh, product for such a small package and. And even if you squeeze it just a bit, like the whole thing puffs up with pressure. So, and you can't. And what the problem is with this packaging is once you open it, once you open it, you have to like do surgery in order to go around it and to get the candy out. And here is where the first major problem is: as soon as you touch the thing, it starts breaking apart and falling apart faster than the Soviet Union. So. So, look, there's already a huge crack going across the middle. You can't, you might not tell it now, however, watch. As soon as I freaking take this thing out. Okay. So now it's out. It's out. We have the Joe Louis right here. And even when I'm just kind of me me messing around with it, you can see, they still see that crack in the middle getting bigger. And that's the second problem. That's a, that's another big problem I have. These things fall so apart so fast. And, and, uh, but yeah, that, so, so far, like, I mean, Joe Louis seemed fine, right? They're fine. So, uh, we're just gonna go for it. Riveting, I know. So, you can already tell, look, that crack in the middle has already fallen apart. Now, this is actually a bad example of them falling apart because, trust me, these things fall apart a lot faster than you'd think. Especially when you're a kid who's always, like, grabbing things tight and, like, uh, eating with two hands and do that. You do this, and it falls apart. And that's where the second problem comes in. The taste isn't even that good. It's bland. You think that, like, a chocolate-covered red velvet cake with with whipped cream in the middle would be would taste amazing, right? Well, you're wrong. It tastes so bland. The chocolate, I mean, it's the fake, you know, processed chocolate that you find in all grocery store candy. However, you think that the red velvet cake would have a bit more flavor. And get this. The freaking texture of the red velvet cake is the exact same as the cream. So you don't get that, like, smoothness of cream that you usually get with, like, when you put, like, it on, like, pie or anything. And, hang on a minute. Let me go do some investigating. The cream doesn't have, actually, it ha the cream has a lot of sugar in it. I think that's where most of the flavor comes in, because if I just eat the red velvet part, it's just, like, sponge. There's nothing there. And, uh, it's just overall not the good candy. I mean, compare this, like, uh, other candy, like, other $5 candies, like, uh, Cosmic Brownies. I really like those. And even though they may be bland, at least they're not a pain in the butt to handle. Uh, 
Plus, also the brownies, and everyone loves brownies, and they actually have texture, too, with the chocolate chips, but I'm getting uh, ahead of myself. So, that's Joe Louis. I uh, wanted to make a quick video. Uh, they're really bad. Uh, yeah, that's that's it. Bye.